Fishing in limbo. See how it goes. Hi everybody, uh, Jerry here. Um, just getting fishing. Um, right now I would say we're, we're kind of in a transitional period. There were a lot of blues around, small ones. Uh, a couple striper being caught, small ones. And uh, of course fluke. Um, I'm just getting started. I'm actually throwing a small jig and, and uh, teaser to start. Um, but uh, interesting time of year. Uh, nothing can happen or anything can happen this time of year. But uh, I got a few lures I want to toss, a uh, few teasers I want to try, a few jigs I want to get out. And uh, I'm starting with a 007. Oh, I just got hit. I'm starting with, I think it was a fluke. I'm starting with a 007 and a UV teaser. Um, I'm trying again. Uh, so let's get started fishing. Get out there and let's see what happens. That's that interesting time of year. He's a small blue. Interesting time of year because you just don't know when it's going to happen, what's going to happen, you know, what's out there. You just got to kind of be prepared. Oh, a little bigger than what we've been getting, that looks like. Well, about what we've been getting. around. I said this stuff is like a trap. So I'm just getting started with a, a 007, a little lighter, and uh, a yarn teaser. That's what I'm going to start the day off with. I'm trying to find that sweet spot. That's a keeper. Well, a nice one anyway. So right now, I switched my setup. I'm gonna try a 27 with a tube tail. Uh, bass like that. And I got a, this is a little bigger teaser. 3-0 hook. I'm gonna try this out. And uh, it's changing things up. I got a couple lures I might try in a little bit. Um, the sun came out, I'm not really liking that, but uh, we'll be getting dark soon, so I think I might just stick with the black teaser. Let's stick it out and let's see if there's anything on this. So right now I just picked something up on this setup. It feels a little bigger. Oh, blue. Look like a blue from here. Yeah, he's a blue. Well, a little bigger today. Oh, I don't want to grab that. transition times, um, uh, limbo almost, I like to uh, 
packed relatively light. Um, some jigs, some lures, definitely teasers, um, night to day stuff. And um, this way you, you're, you're kind of prepared, but you're not. And you're still out catching fish, reading the water, seeing what's going on. And two tides will make a big difference um, this time of year. Really, the, the bass can relate any time. They're definitely around. So, just fishing it through. Looks like that fluke went for that black teaser. But, uh, alright, let's just fish and maybe we'll pick something else up. Playing this, this is in the current. Seems a little slow, but Be a fluke. And it is a fluke. Small ones that know how to play the, the surf. Let's see what he took. Maybe he took the jig, maybe. Oh, oh, striper! Striper on a teaser. He's a keeper. He's definitely a keeper. First keeper of the year. Well, we're pretty darn close. Took that teaser. That's why you look like about 26, 27 maybe. Maybe kissing. A little short. That's 28 over here. He's about 26. Great to see. I thought he was a big blue, a little blue, but moisturous one. Like I say this time of year is funny. Um, it's really not consistent. That's why I call it a limbo. You're gonna have, you never know what you're gonna get. It could be good, the fishing. It could be bad. We'll just take it for what it is. Um, if I pick out another striper, I might do something different. Um, it is bright sun right now. So that's a good sign. They're not being spooky. Maybe night, I'm thinking. And uh, probably might, all kinds of things can happen now. But uh, took the black. So now it's a matter of, I might put on a naked jig, just so I can work that teaser better. I might even put on a lure to work it through the middle. It might not be looking so much down. Okay, just hooked up again. I don't know what he is. I don't know what, what is that? Sea robin or something? Oh, it's a fluke! <laughs> oh, it's a fluke. As you can see, I just picked the bass out here. So, when they tell you that the uh, fluke and bass, some birds, when fluke and bass relate to the same structure, uh, they really do. Um, that's why I say you fish it out in the summer and you come out in fall and uh, hit 
picked those spots you hit out in the summer and picked out those fluke or stargazers, sea robins, bluefish, all kind of hang out on that structure. Uh, this is the time of the year that you're going to get those trifectas, quadfectas, um, even who knows. Like, you don't really know. Just the fish is kind of starting to relate and move and set up. So, so I call it limbo. Uh, you're kind of in the middle of seasons. We're fishing limbo here. It's a tough time to fish, but it can be rewarding. Like I said, you might be better off in the back if you're looking for bass exclusively right now, but I like I like this. This is something nice. It's definitely bigger. It feels bouncing like a blue. Maybe we get a look at him. These blues do fight good. Not big, big, but. Here. Yeah, he was, he's a blue. I was happy they weren't around. Well, not really happy, but they wreak havoc on those teasers there. There it is. Snapper. So now I am I'm throwing a naked uh, A17 on a black teaser. I'm going to stick to that. For now, I um, might have some more as I might throw. As the sun drops, maybe fish a little closer in. But uh, I hope these blues did not take over. It's going to make it hard to get into anything else. Fun getting one here and there. Well, fun getting a lot when you get them. But uh, just looking to see what's out there. They make it tough to do when they're thick. Some stri stripes. Oh, he's a blue. And they're on the black. A little chunkier. They bend. He nailed that good. Bit far out. Check. Let's see. Yep. The tiny, tiny ones seem to be a little thinner. These things just grow so fast. The fish are seem to be off the lip today, most of all of them. So I do pack the fly rod. I'd love to get into them with that, but it's just not feasible at the moment. I'm fishing in limbo here. I say this is just fishing the limbo, and you never know what you're gonna get. Uh, if you can even get anything, um, you're going to have, of course, well, you can see they're all eating well. Most of the fish all have big distended bellies on them, but you never know what you're going to get, if you're going to get anything. Um, but this is good fishing for this time of year, definitely good fishing. So the sun's going down now, so I'm going to finish off the day. I'm going to throw a, uh, a, uh, a chicken scratch uh, swimmer and uh, I'm going to keep on that black too. So. Good combo. Um, I haven't had a fish in a half hour or so. so it slowed off. I think it's the bottom of the tide. It should start coming in. All right, let me uh, get out there. Maybe we'll pick one up. If not, I'll see you soon. Okay. Wow. 
a fluke out of the deal. <laughs> it's shallow, so the is right and just right. Coming up from the bottom for it, that's a, that's a good thing. So today, we're fishing in limbo. That's what I call it. It's just that time of year called limbo. You never know, you're between a bite, a predictable bite. All right, everybody, um, the sun's tipping out. I'm gonna be fishing a little bit more. Actually, I'm gonna set up a new leader, but uh, fishing in limbo here, uh, not bad for this time of year. Um, had uh, some fluke, uh, bluefish, uh, striped bass. Um, they should slowly be relating to the beach. Um, actually, you might have a better shot early in the morning or late at night at them out here. Um, maybe throw something bigger, some big teasers, I don't know. But uh, for this time of year, I can't complain. Uh, got out for a few hours, picked out some fish, had some action and uh, just wait for the fishing to pick up. But uh, thanks again for watching. And uh, please like, dislike. Uh. Wow, he just, that gotta be a blue. It's dark, I don't know if you guys can see, but I'll turn on the light when he comes in. It's gotta be a blue. See a blue? No, he's a little striper. Oh wow. Little guy. Oh. Thought he was blue. I'll take a few more casts. It's a couple. Probably a few more now. Battery died. Battery died. And remember, always fish your way. Thanks again for watching.